at Numerian Capital, we bring you the latest stock news each day. Please like and subscribe so we can bring these articles to you each day. Thank you. Today, January 6, 2023, DraftKings insiders are betting big on DKNG stock. Three insiders just loaded up on DraftKings stock. Three DraftKings executives, including CEO Jason Robbins, have acquired more than 1 million shares of the company since December. DraftKings insiders have amounted to a net activity of 311,561 shares sold in the past year. Shares of DraftKings stock are down by over 50% during the past year. Shares of DraftKings, NASDAQ DKNG, are in full focus following three exercise and hold transactions of DraftKings stock options by three executives, including CEO Jason Robbins. To kick off the new year, DraftKings announced in December that it would begin hosting its sports book services in Ohio starting on January 1st. Customers in Ohio will now be able to bet on a variety of sports leagues offered by the company, including the NBA, NFL, NHL, MLS and more. DraftKings North America President and Co-Founder Matt Kalish added, We're excited to ring in the new year with the launch of our top-rated DraftKings Sportsbook app in Ohio. Ohioans are passionate sports fans with hometown pride, and we're thrilled to offer them a variety of ways to have more skin in the game ahead of the 2023 College Football Playoff National Championship and the NFL Playoffs. With that in mind, let's get into the details of the DraftKings Stock Insider Acquisitions. Three Executives Acquire Shares The first transaction is attributable to CEO Jason Robbins. On December 29th, the CEO reported exercising stock options to receive 1.02 million shares of DraftKings at prices between $0.63 cents and $4.70. Following the exercise, Robbins now directly owns a total of 5.69 million shares and indirectly owns 83,000 shares through a family trust. He also directly owns options to receive 6.65 million shares and indirectly owns options to receive 892,264 shares through a family trust. On the same day, CFO Jason Park reported exercising options to receive 50,000 shares at an average price of $4.70 per share. Following the transaction, he now directly owns 474,404 shares and indirectly owns 300,000 shares through family trusts. Additionally, the CFO also directly owns stock options to receive 425,475 shares. Finally, Kalish reported exercising options to receive 123,308 shares on December 31st. Like Robbins, the shares received were priced between $0.63 cents and $4.70. After the exercise, Kalish now owns directly owns 2.65 million shares and indirectly owns 454,001 shares through two family trusts. Furthermore, he owns stock options to directly receive 851,977 shares. So, how do other insiders view DraftKings? In the past year, insiders have acquired 19.6 million shares and sold 19.91 million shares. That adds up to a net activity of 311,561 shares sold. Thanks for watching. Numerian Capital News. Please come back tomorrow for another stock news update. Thank you.